talk about the Oscars without talking about the fashion, and you really can't talk about the fashion, <laughs> all right, without having Steve Kimball here from U.S. Weekly's Fashion Police and the conversation. So the answer, right, about yes. the fashion last night was a yes. You yes. liked most things, right? I wish right? we would have had a little bit more drama, right? Me too. I was hoping. Just a little Ariana bit more. Grande, she gave us the drama. Oh, she did. <laughs> okay. She definitely brought the drama in that big, poofy, pink outfit. I, I mean, it. it was grande, right? <laughs> it, it really, really was. Really was. It and it really was. just was. like, I mean, look at this. It's like and anybody else would have walked out in that comforter and we would have been like, what are you wearing? But <laughs> she can get away comforter. with the absurdity of it all. But I'll tell you this, if there is a her. cotton candy shortage at the state fair this year, we need to blame her. She, there it is, right there. She was the cutest little cupcake. I okay. know, what okay. she, I love her. Okay, here we go with the pink, right? Yes. Let's start the ladies from Barbie. They were really killing it last night. Oh my night. gosh, they really were. But did you see, we were wanting this beautiful farewell to the cultural phenomenon that I swept know. the globe. And Margot Robbie, we wanted her in pink. But she was probably tired of wearing oh, all the well, pink Well, she all was, year. and you know, she wore it all year long. They said that she wanted to let the other people shine. Okay, you know, which she I did. Get that. She really, she really did. did. I love the black Versace gown she wore, the structured bodice, the dropped waistline. Her hair was simple. She wore one Fred Layton bracelet. That is it. But then America, America Ferrara, who is not Gorgeous. wearing pink at all through the oh, promotional tour, right. through the award season, she gave us this fabulous splash of pink Versace again chainmail dress, I think it's absolutely stunning. Yeah, and a lot of the women, they wore these structured kind of yes, gowns. very much so. Very, very much structured. So. It looked very uncomfortable, yeah, right? It, it did, <laughs> but it still looked good. They had the Oh, oh the yeah, oh, oh they gosh. did, oh, they did. But remember, that's like a million dollars going down the red carpet. You're They've got hair, makeup, right. dress, jewelry, everything. They've got teams. What about Lisa? Oh, look at her. Well, she looks Ooh. absolutely fabulous. Mm -hmm. However, this Marquesa gown is beautiful. She wore these towering heels, but I don't know if you saw it. She's walking along on the red carpet mm -hmm. and she took a tumble. I mean, I she know. plummeted to the bottom of the red carpet. It was just that like, right. bam. That always, ladies, you always gotta like test your heels and your dress together. I don't care if you're going to lunch, Dinner or the Oscars red carpet, put them on together. Because when she fell, I thought, oh, she probably had never walked in that together. I know, and then, you know, to have the team kind of holding your train and all and of that. Exactly. Steve, such a pleasure to have oh, you. You're, you're not it. going anywhere. You're still oh, no, I'll be back. Yes, I'm, yes, we got right? more, we got more. All right, let's talk weather. <laughs> let's go to meteorologist Maria Ruiz. Maria, we're talking, what, things for this week? I've got so busy looking at Steve's blazer over here as well. It's bright <laughs> like the sun. I was just saying he's our sunshine this morning because we're looking at cloud cover to start the